the filmmakers say the training is to show students that there is a career in the industry and helping them produce work that will be part of the expected 2017 Juba Film Festival. They're going to produce their own stories and bring it in this festival and then the judges will watch and bring the three on top and then we're going to award them. So we prepare them so they go out, go back to the school and share and make sure they're ready for the next festival. South Sudan is a country without cinema, let alone film schools. Equipment like camera is also rare. So the students are trained to use smartphones to write scripts and shoot their pictures. I used to try myself lying to the rest of my fellow brothers that I'm also a script writer. But when I come in here, I just get full detail of a script writer. And by the way, I have gained a lot of things. Before even I don't know how to use camera and how to make film, but now I am able and I can do it. And even when I, went to, when I go back to my school, I can teach other of my colleagues how to use the camera and how to make films. South Sudan is a country with many armed groups and many of the secondary school students here are either in the armed forces or were child soldiers. Learning filmmaking skills could be one way of helping the secondary school students learn new ways of expressing themselves rather than using guns to make their points. Patrick Oyet, CCTV, Juba, South Sudan.